Session Types and Topics Types From this grid, you can add new types of sessions and events and edit existing ones. Click on the Add Type button. A pop-up window will appear. All required fields are indicated with a red asterisk. Add the session type name, for example, Poster Sessions, a description for it, if necessary, choose a color, and indicate if the type is for use in a session or as an event. The difference between events and sessions is that the session consists of assigned abstracts, and the event does not. Events are usually non-formal gatherings such as registration, reception, coffee breaks, meals, that you may want to include in your program. This window allows you to color code your sessions or event types, which can later be useful when you are scheduling your sessions in the session grid. Set your preferences for this session type by entering any of the default values below, such as the maximum number of presentations per session or default duration. The Include in IP and Display Individual Presentation Times in IP checkboxes are used by societies who have the itinerary planner configured on their site. By checking this box, sessions of this type will be included and displayed in the built-in itinerary planner. Check this box if you plan to assign the same submission to multiple sessions, otherwise the system will prevent a submission from being assigned to more than one session. You are also able to export this grid to Excel, as well as import your sessions or event types by downloading a template. Be careful to use the available resources to fill out your template. Topics. Session topics are typically used as a secondary way of categorizing sessions into related groups. For example, earlier you may have created an oral or poster session type, but you may also want to break these groups down further into, say, basic or clinical-based sessions, or according to submission category, depending on how your program is organized. Create your topics in the same manner as you have created your session types, by entering a topic name, description if needed, and choosing whether it is a session or event topic. You will later be able to select your topic when creating a new session.